Jai Sachidanan. This is the morning of the 6th of November, the day of the Janma Jayanti birth celebrations. This is the day according to the Indian calendar that Nani Purushtada Shri would have become 107 years old. His actual birth according to the world calendar was November 7th of 1907. <clears throat> anyway, see this. Now we have our Gnani about to uh, conduct what we in the spiritual world of Akram Vignan have become familiar with called the VD uh, of Jagat Kalyan. And we will see which particular aspect. There are many VDs of the salvation of the world very special ones that are conducted by our Gnani Pujadipak Bhai at major occasions like Guru Purnima, <clears throat> the Anjanma Jayanti. And we will see which topic he chooses for this one. So this is a live, informal English voiceover. And he let us begin. Jai Sachidanan. This is the celebration of Gnani Purush Dada Shri and Dada Bhagwan within him on his. And let us have this message for this year from Gnani Purush Dada Shri and Dada Bhagwan that whatever the files that are there, which are close files, especially the spiritual colleagues, the husband and woman, wife will become separate in two to three lives. But the spiritual colleagues will come very close to each other and for many more long time under the same spiritual leader. They will have extreme types of rag towards each other and then they will have extreme dvesh towards each other. And so the spiritual colleagues carry on for a much longer time than the married couples. So, so let us now make a decision that I will, I want to win a sticky file which is of a spiritual colleague through equanimity. Uh, whatever may be his fault and, and whatever fault my intellect may show of his, but I want to see him as flawless for sure. I want to have oneness with, with his pure soul only. And it is the prakriti, the non-self that is showing the negativity but it is the filled stock that is emptying. <clears throat> and I want to finish, finish this account. I do not want to see a single fault of my spiritual colleague. This must be the very firm and in unflinching Nishche determination on our part and then win him with love. Let us bring in oneness and love within this relationship. And the moment uh, some talk comes out, then the faults are being seen and then the hurt happens. Hurt is sh shared and we do not want to enter into this kind of faults. Uh, no matter how good they may be or how good I may be or how correct I may be, I have no right to hurt anyone that this is the Dada's work should be done this way only and Dada's work should not be done this way, etc. Any such insistence will lead to Kashais and actually the work of Dada is being done by scientific circumstantial evidences and also by the celestial beings. It is not under our, the control of our own will. And so, and there is the protection of the celestial beings, the male and the female celestial protecting beings. So why should there be any room for I am correct and my way is correct, etc.? Yes, you can have meetings and you can have joint sessions, but come to some kind of a solution. But we do not want to hurt anybody in this. And this is, then only we will become free from the sticky file of a spiritual colleague. Uh, so let us, uh, uh, let us make the determination. We want to apply all the gnan in this matter. We want to apply the evidences of flawlessness, the double A, double B, adjust everywhere, avoid clashes. Whatever has happened is justice and the fault is of the sufferer. 
and along with the gnan we want to win each and every spiritual colleague we the world is not our file the worldly population is not our file but we may have just 2 3 4 5 6 or 10 files only but if we can win one file with knowledge gnan then so many kashayas within the prakriti will be overcome therefore we have to make the nishchay we do not need to improve them in any way let us become free from our own kashayas of my own stickiness in this particular kashay that i need to get let go of and and let us win in this way let us remain in the agnas and then win the files and in this way we will become free from the kashayas and we will become clean in this manner our prakriti will become clean and then on that day our file will not be sticky let us make the firm determination that i want to settle a sticky file of spiritual colleague with economity everyone understands this here everybody has got a hat according to the size of his head so you see everybody has got a head a hat according to the size of his head so we have to find out you know you know the whole world may be praising the other person but we find faults with that person so we are seeing that man or a woman through yellow glasses of and so we need to clear off this faulty vision that exists within us Yes, the was the the Sri says that the, it is our own faulty vision that makes us see yellow and red everywhere, where it should be easy going and smooth. Today is a very major day. Let us ask for the great amazing energies from our Gnani Purush Dada Sri and the Dada Bhagwan within him. And the Dada Sri says, whenever you remember me, or whenever you recall me, or whenever you want me, I will be there for you. and so let us have this nischay determination for moksha today we have a very good bhavna on samayik of jagat kalyan of uh, this is excellent is magnificent and let us do it with upayog applied awareness and as i make you read it recite it please follow the sentences it's almost hey dada bhagwan the absolute self within me hey shri simandar swami prabhu the lord at mahavide the fully enlightened one hey niruma purve satmagnani please come here please come here and in and please take a seat within our hearts of all of us please reside in the voice box of the pakwai you make you speak and we will follow you and this is for the salvation of the world and this is the heartfelt intentions please accept them for the work of jagat kalyan to happen let me become the nimit let me become pure as a nimit please grace us to me to become a pure nimit i surrender the mind speech and body all illusions associated with my name bhav karma charge karma dravya karma subtle discharge karma no karma gross discharge karma O oh, Dada Bhagwan, the absolute self within me, you are the very manifest absolute self, Paramatma, Lord within me, and I am surrendering them, all these to you at your divine feet, my Lord. Hush, hush, Shuddhatma, Chu, I am pure soul. Hush, Shuddhatma, Chu, I am pure soul. Hush, Shud. Dhatmachu, I am pure soul. Oh, we should dhatmachu. I am absolute pure soul. Oh, we should dhatmachu. I am absolute pure soul. Oh, we should dhatmachu. I am absolute pure soul. Oh, we should dhatmachu. I am absolute pure soul. Oh, 
हूँ परम ज्योति स्वरूप सिद्ध भगवान छू आई एम दी एप्सोलूट लाइट ऑफ दी एप्सोलूट सेल्फ हूँ परम ज्योति स्वरूप सिद्ध भगवान छू आई एम दी फुल्ली अकम्पलिश्ड एप्सोलूट सेल्फ ऑफ एप्सोलूट लाइट हूँ परम ज्योति स्वरूप सिद्ध भगवान छु आई एम दूटली एन लाइट एंड लोड विद दूट लाइट हूँ अनंत ज्ञान वालो छु आई एम विथ इन्फिनेट नॉलेज हूँ अनंत ज्ञान वालो छु आई एम विथ इन्फिनेट नॉलेज हूँ अनंत ज्ञान वालो छु आई एम विथ इन्फिनेट नॉलेज आई एम हूँ अनंत दर्शन वालो छु आई एम विथ इन्फिनेट विजन आई एम फिल्ड विथ इन्फिनेट विजन I am filled with infinite vision. Who anant darshan vado chu? Who anant shakti vado chu? I am infinite energy. Who anant shakti vado chu? I am filled with infinite energy. Who anant shakti vado chu? I am infinite energy. Who anant sukhnu dham chu? I am the abode of infinite bliss. Who anant sukhnu dham chu? I am the abode of infinite bliss. Who anant sukhnu विषयों मोहनी अनेक प्रकार की होवा बिकॉज ऑफ दी लूजरी अटैचमेंट टू ऑफ सेक्शुअलिटीज ऑफ एन डिफरेंट काइंड अगेन्स्ट देम आई एम द वन विथ इन्फिनेट ब्लिस दैट विच टेम्प्स द चित एंड एंड स्नेर्स इट इन टू ग्रीड बिकॉज इट इज ऑफ इन्फिनेट अकाउंटलेस काइंड अगेन्स्ट दैट आई एम द ब्लिसफुल वन I am the abode of bliss. My abode of infinite bliss, because I cannot understand the very fact that I am the abode of bliss only. I, I, I. The chit roves around and wanders around looking for pleasure. Chit, by very nature, looks for pleasure only. because it cannot find its own original real bliss it enters into the temporary destructible things to look for pleasure and the chit wanders there and looks for pleasure and because destructible things are not eternal the pleasure that is derived from such things is also not eternal either therefore chit there again goes into some other areas to seek pleasure and by in this such wanderings of search of pleasure the chit ultimately ties zeros in on sexual sex sex and sexuality and because of the pleasure because because of because the pleasure that is found in sex is a little bit more intense than other avenues of pleasure the chit gets stuck there and then it gets it plays in sex and sexuality only and when to get more and more pleasure from sex and sexuality only it continues to go after sex only but when the chit has been is shown and it attains a higher um, kind of pleasure than the sexual pleasure then automatically the sexual uh, cravings and sexual pleasures will appear insipid against it and this eternal bliss of one's own is shown by the gnani purush and once once one experiences the eternal bliss within and once taste after tasting this the chit never then moves from that source of bliss and the state of that chit is the one kind of chit ek chit that ultimately enters into infinite samadhi or infinite unaffected state to from today onwards i'm making the firm inflinching this decision that that i will uh, remain uh, within my eternal bliss which is indestructible only and once this play within my own bliss has been attained sexual pleasures will definitely appear insipid and tasteless what dada bhagwan dignani purush dada shri is given 
Uh, the, uh, this is the extra agna of Gnani Purush Dada Shri, so that I will have the extra awareness and application of this particular agna of Dada. Therefore, as a result of this, I will remain within the goal, I will be able to remain in the goal of my salvation of the world as well as I will be able to attain that goal. And the goal of my salvation of the world is my, is the goal of, of of my goal in this life. Let the world attain salvation, and for that, and for that, the world will ask for shield, which is morality and freedom from kashais, absolute. Seg, uh, and the world will ask for siyadvat speech, that which does not hurt anyone. Not a single living being should not be hurt. To the slightest extent, and will not have the slightest extent of uh, of hurt. Uh, such speech is needed and is absolutely necessary. And for to have this kind of non-insistent siyadvat speech, brahmacharya, absolute freedom from sexual impulses, uh, is an absolute must. And it and and the speech which is without brahmacharya, without it is associated with uh, some kind of insistence in some way or the other, and and we uh, we want to share our truth only for the salvation of the other person only, not to feed our own ego at a, uh, of any kind. And the and the, in the in the in the in the intent of the Jagat Kalyan of Bhavna. Let me not enter into any kind of competitiveness or competition or rivalry with anyone because of rivalry and competitiveness. The, the, the Jagat Kalyan will be kept on one side only, but I would end up hurting my own self in a severe way. And therefore, today I am making the firm decision, unflinching decision that I will. Uh, Remain. I, I that I, I will remain in the intention of Jagat Kalyan, the, and in that I will not allow a single subatomic particle of ego to enter into it. That I will remain, and I will I will continue to have the intention of absolute pure salvation of the world only. Let the entire world attain salvation. Let the entire world attain salvation. Let the entire world attain salvation. That whether the salvation of the world happens through any nimit, it is the same as having happened through my own nimit. So therefore, because my goal is the salvation of the world, not exclusively the salvation of the world and nothing else. And th there is no importance of the nimit in that goal, whether it is my nimit or the nimit of someone else. Uh, but but my goal is on Jagat Kalyan only, salvation of the world only, and it is indeed essentially and exclusively the salvation of the world only. So through what whichever nimit this uh, happens. Uh, and as accomplished, it is is the same as having accomplished through my own nimit, for sure. Whatever whatever circumstance a nimit gets in in the salvation of the world, let a uh, let the world attain salvation through whatever circumstance that nimit gets it, and that is the accomplishment of my own goal for sure. And let and and my bliss lies in the same level as if I was the nimit. Today I am making the firm, unflinching decision that that I will continue to see the nimit of the jagat kalyan only. So let it be whichever nimit it is. Let it happen. And let my highest congr congratulations and best wishes and blessings be there for this nimit, oh, and, and for uh, all the nimits who are have proceeded forward on the path of the salvation of the world, they are all have only one goal only, and they are they have my goal only, because we are of one goal only, we are one 
uh, for sure. And first of all, for these nimits of Jagat Kalyan, let me become one with them, obeyed without any divisiveness. Let, ne let there be no separation or divisiveness with them for me. And for that, for that, let me remain acutely aware, ex extremely aware. And, let, and thereafter, I will need to become one with the entire world. And for having the oneness with the entire world, having attained that, I will attain my final goal, which is, apart from the oneness, uh, without, with, uh, if I, no one will, with the exception of oneness, no one will accept my talk. If there is the slightest divisive intellect we are rising, then the other person will not accept my words. For the arising and for the production of oneness, one will need to be a Buddha, means without any interference of the intellect. Interference of the intellect will not do. By seeing the slightest fault of the other person, the divisive intellect arises. And the divisive intellect that arises, forget about helping the other person, it will not happen. It will not happen through my name it because the divisive intellect has arisen. For the salvation of the other person, the obey the buddhi, the intellect that is not divisive and that which and complete oneness will be needed. And for complete oneness to happen, the tattva drashti or elemental vision and the upyog, the applied awareness of that will be needed. And for the applied awareness of elemental vision, and through the elemental vision of applied awareness of elemental vision, it is possible to become one with the entire world. And this is the key to become uh, 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 one with the entire world. And the, and the major key to that is to see that person as the absolute self, Paramatma Swarup only, and that is who he or she really is. And that is the vision that needs to be nurtured, nurtured, let the entire world attain salvation. Let the entire world attain salvation. Let the entire world attain salvation. Through this uh, current mind, speech, and body, let, let it all flow and let it all be, let it all go, let it all go towards the salvation of the world only. Let this mind, speech, and body dissolve towards one. one Man, it's well, Jagat Kalyan only. This mind, speech, and body is of not my ownership. I am not the owner. I have, I have this surrendered this mind, speech, and body to the feet of the Gnani Purush, and Gnani Purush has surrendered his own mind, speech, and body to the entire world only. Therefore, my mind, speech, and body too have been surrendered to the entire world. And so here they are here by being surrendered to the entire world. This mind, speech, and body, let it, let it be spent. Let it be spent for the salvation of the entire world only. By my own nature, uh, I am, I am absolute knowledge only and nothing else. Uh, the exception of the absolute knowledge only, the, no other state, no other nature is mine. Uh, except for Kevar Gnan, absolute knowledge state, all other states are, are of the Putgal, the Purangal and the non-self complex. The mind, speech, and body, and and all the relative uh, illusions of the Lord are uh, are with form, and I am in without form, just like the sky. 
in this body whatever formless part that is is there like the sky the space that is filled with my own state my state is absolute knowledge state only that very state is that of lord simander too that absolute knowledge state is of of all the fully enlightened siddha bhagwans also and that very absolute knowledge state is of every living being for sure that very absolute knowledge state only and through that state i have i am one with every living being in this universe in that one state of the self let me be in the worship of that state only and with that vision of oneness let me see every living being and that and then i will remain as one with the entire world let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain salvation the ent- all the saints of this entire world and all the enlightened beings of this entire world those who have attained the self and the manifest gnani purush hoy dada bhagwan within gnani purush dada shri and our current gnani may please do the salvation of this entire world please do the salvation of this entire world please do the salvation of the entire world oh dada bhagwan the absolute self within let let the entire world attain salvation that bhavana the deepest inner intention let it remain permanently carved and etched within my heart and and through that let let and my, let let my uh, the all types of my ego flow along that path only and my and 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 the ego from every corner of my body of my uh, non self complex let it all flow towards jagat kalyan salvation of the world only and so to make the ego rootless this jagat kalyan is the only solution the ego otherwise is not possible to be uprooted wherever the ego has got stuck in any other topics of pleasure let that ego i want to turn that ego towards the intention of jagat kalyan only and ultimately and ultimately that ego that has become absorbed and weaved into the uh, in salvation of the world will attain purity by gradually and then it will become and then will become nothing but the pure intention of jagat kalyan only and then ultimately there is nothing but absolute pure intent of salvation of the uh, world only and when when this kind of purity of jagat kalyan intent arises then big, then there is the expression of compassion and and at that time karunyata the the special quality of compassion arises within and at that time the ego completely uh, and so then and so then 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 the ego completely disappears and then let and then let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain self let let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain salvation let the entire world attain salvation mun mun chu shuddhatma chu ishvin rayne sile also ama pura me shuddhatma chu शुद्धात्मा शुद्धात्मा 
शुद्धात्मा छु 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 सोमपुरा 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 इश्बिन रायन सीले 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 शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा छु शुद्धात्मा 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 छु 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 जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद जय सच्चिदानंद